2K Sports and the Corn Ferry Tour are proud to bring you this year's Q School Final. We're glad to have your company as we kick off our coverage of this tournament. Luke Elvey here alongside Rich Beam and Rich, you know exactly how challenging these Q Schools are. Luke, all the players in this field want one thing and one thing only, and that is their Corn Ferry Tour card. It's a massive accomplishment. Let's see how this all shakes out. The top 50 on the leaderboard will get their card. Big day coming up. Can't wait to see how it unfolds, Rich. This should be an absolute beauty. Let's see what kind of tone he sets for himself today. Oh, that's a high caliber shot. Around 110 yards to go. They're not a bad shot, that one. Be nice to see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. Oh, what a great stroke. Oh, that's a lengthy putt. Well hold. Yeah, you got to love seeing those go in early. Puts you in a good mood for the rest of the day. He's currently tied for sixth. Can't birdie them all unless you birdie the first, Luke. Good start. And after a birdie at the last, they take the honor on the hole. That reminded me of the Big Easy, silky smooth. Time for the second shot here on the second hole. Getting ready to play their third. Thirteen feet to the cup. Oh, so close. Putting for par. Well hold. Currently one under for the day. Always like to see your name moving up the leaderboard. Never a bad thing. Ooh, we're at the par three here. I love these holes. Going with a three wood here. Didn't quite have the right stuff there. Needed to take a little less club on that approach.
And this would be a great power putt if he can make this. Looking good. And in it goes for the par. And there's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. Tea is yours. Here we are at the fourth hole. Well struck. Playing from around 240 yards. Just a couple back from our leader. Opting for the three wood. Well, that'll work up on the dance floor. Could have been worse. And John, uh, how long's this putt? It seems to be a fair way. I'd say it's about 29 feet from where I'm standing. Okay, steady now. And that should secure the par. Well done. And after that hole, this is how the leaderboard looks. Trailing by a couple of strokes now. Let's see what happens here at the fifth. Now this one looks to be heading down the runway. from about 130 yards here. Only two shots off the pace. Going with the 9-iron, nine nine, I think. Wow, what a shot. Good opportunity here to move into a tie for third. Hey, nice looking line. Yeah, nice mid-range birdie putt, that one. Got to say, putting this well from this distance is a huge confidence booster. Nicely played. Moving on up the leaderboard now after that hole. I'm pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. That should find the fairway. Second shot here on the sixth. Opting for the five wood. Well, that's a handy shot. Let's see if we can make this big putt for birdie. Ooh, right by the hole. This putt's about four feet from the hole. Oh, that looks like a pure stroke. Currently two under for the event.
deep into the front nine. Here we are at the seventh hole. Mm -mm. A thing of beauty. Bit untidy, wasn't it? Oh my, that's a putrid lie. Can he get out of here? No, I'm not seeing a whole lot of ball in the sand here, guys. Let's see how they deal with this one. Okay, so that's step one. But now I've got to hold a mid-range putt. Oh, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. Putt is underway. And that's a way to fight back from a tough break. Well hold. And that'll put a little pep in your step up and down from the bunker in for the birdie. Good job. He's currently tied for first. Gotta like it, moving up the leaderboard. Never a bad thing. Let's see what happens here at the eighth. Wonderfully played. That's tidy. Trying to get it to four under with this part. Go on, get in the hole. The putt drops, and that's back-to-back -back birdies. And that will take him to four under. And at the end of that hole, he's gone into clear outright leader. The lead is getting bigger and bigger. Ooh, I always love these holes. Here we have a par three. And he's not hit the mark on that approach. A bit short with that effort. Yeah, that one will play. This putt just five feet away from the hole. Oh, what a stroke. And there it is. All right, Rich, we've made the turn now into the final nine. What are your thoughts so far? Yeah, good spot, isn't it? I got to say, I'd rather be in the lead or tied for the lead than in the chasing pack. Gives you just a little margin of error should you have one. But I got to say, this player is awfully solid. Oh, that sounded absolutely flushed. <laughs> Sitting at four under for the day, currently tied for top spot.
choosing the nine iron here. A wonderful shot and a chance for Birdie here on the 10th. Luke, nothing gets past you. Yes, this kid is a stud. This one started out on a good line. Mark it down, that's birdie number five. And with that, he'll move to five under par. Still in the lead now after that hole. Always positive coming off a birdie. Let's see what happens here. This looks to be heading for the cut stuff. Second shot here on the 11th. Nicely done. And here we are with the third shot. Make sure you get both the line and the speed right here. It's a long part. Their short game today has been absolutely sublime fun to watch. Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hold. An opportunity to make their par. Okay, let's head to the next. Our current leader is enjoying a one-shot lead. Two great shots are required here because this hole is a long par four. Oh, great swing there. This shot from around 210 yards. Seems to have chosen the three wood. Not a bad approach that one. Not quite inside the booty range, but you never know. Hull a long one, still counts. Slim chance here for birdie, but you never know. Oh, that's frustrating. And with that, you can go and put a par on the card. Now leading by one shot. Let's see what happens here at the 13th. That looks to be a fair way finder to me. That's an absolute ripper. What a shot. 
Almost a gimme birdie there, Luke. Fantastic. His putt is of nine feet. It's half a chance of being hold this one. But he just keeps putting a gap on the rest of the field. What a putt to hold. And that will take him to six under. And now that finds him in first place. Let's see what happens here at the 14th. Going with a three wood here. Oh, well done. Oh, this is a long way from downtown, but you're closer. John, what's he got in front of him? I'd say about 26 feet or so to the cup from here. Ouch, that hurts. And they'll walk away with a par on this one. So after that hole, this is what the leaderboard looks like. Our current leader is enjoying a two-stroke lead. We have a par four on this one. Absolutely flushed. Second shot here on the 15th. <laughs> Going with the hybrid. What a shot. Now this is some ball striking. Hitting greens in regulation. It's a thing of beauty. I tell you, you just dream about days like today. Greens in regulation, spot on all day. Awesome. And mark it down. That's birdie number seven on the scorecard. And with that, he'll move to seven under. Incredible. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. And coming off the birdie, they'll be proud of themselves, a chance to keep it rolling. Time for the second shot at the 16th. That's just inside the range. Birdie at the last. This for another. All the great players make a bunch of these. This is from 15 feet. was a gallant attempt four feet to the cup oh just missed this one's for bogey yeah well hold let's move on to the next he sits in first position
Just a couple to go. Let's see how you handle the penultimate hole. Looks like they've got the five wood. Uh, I'm not sure that's what they had in their mind. That's further right than they wanted. Okay, not the best result, but a chance to get up and down. And what a rare miss today. They've been so good with their approach shots. He has this putt to save his par. That's well hold. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. Teeing off here at the lucky last, the 18. Oh, that is crushed. Nicely done. Sitting at six under for the day. Currently in top spot. Opting for the nine iron. Oh, this one should find the surface. Good shot, this. Yeah, a quality shot, that. This putt is about 15 feet to the hole. Ooh. Par putt coming up here. And with that putt, concludes this player's round. There you have it, folks. At the end of the opening round, they find themselves in top spot. Not bad, eh, Rich? Yeah, slim margin right now. Lots of golf left to play. And you got to think that those players in the chasing pack, they're just licking their chops. They can't wait for the next few days. Let's see what happens. Well, on behalf of myself, Rich Beam, and all the hardworking folks at HB Studios, thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.